Take the pen tool from the toolbox, move it onto the work, left click and release to create anchor points. It's important that you don't drag the mouse when you actually click on it. You click and release and that will create straight lines. When you're finished you can connect to the first point to create a closed path object. So, you can use this technique to draw around straight sided objects such as boxes and so on. The trick is to left click and release the mouse. Never move the mouse when you're holding the mouse button down. If you left click and release, you will create straight lines. Left click and release, left click and release, left click and release, left click and release, all the way around. I've made a mistake on this one, this point's in the wrong place. We can easily fix that by going to the direct selection tool, deselecting the anchor points by clicking outside the object, clicking on a line to highlight the anchor points and then clicking and dragging the anchor point we want to move. Anchor points that are black like this one are selected, anchor points that are white are not selected. We'll finish off this tutorial with a quick example. I've got two boxes here that I'm going to trace around using the path tool. And I'm going to do it using straight lines like I did in the last example. All the way around. Don't worry too much if you uh, make a small mistake. You can always adjust the position of these points by taking the white selection tool and then just moving them slightly like this. all the others seem to be okay so what we'll do now is we'll go to the paths palette and click on this little button here load path as selection and that converts the path into a selection which we can then copy to the clipboard and paste into another document so I'll switch to another document now and control V to paste it in